Imagine you're starting a new job. The environment is friendly, your colleagues are helpful, and your boss is particularly supportive, often praising your efforts. A few weeks in, the same boss casually mentions how fortunate you are to have been hired, given your limited experience. Suddenly, you feel a pang of insecurity. Was all the praise a setup for this undermining comment? This scenario exemplifies everyday manipulation, a subtle yet pervasive element in many social interactions. It's not always about sinister motives. Sometimes it's about control, influence, or insecurity manifesting through manipulative tactics. Now consider different manipulation techniques and how they contrast in their approach and impact. The first, as seen in our scenario, is the surprise hit. This technique involves building someone up with kindness and compliments only to later use a negative comment to create self-doubt. It's quick, surprising, and often leaves the individual questioning their value. In contrast, love bombing is the marathon of manipulation techniques. It starts with overwhelming affection and attention, creating a strong emotional bond. This bond, however, gradually morphs into a tool for control as the manipulator begins to withdraw affection or intersperse it with criticism, creating an addictive push and pull dynamic. Then there's the tactic of leaving things unsaid. This method plays on human curiosity and the fear of missing out. By hinting at something intriguing and then withholding details, the manipulator creates a sense of dependency. You find yourself drawn in, eager to learn more, only to find that the withheld information is a lever to influence your actions. Pretending inaccessibility is another subtle form of manipulation. After establishing a connection, the manipulator suddenly becomes distant, sending mixed signals like the cryptic SMS. I don't know if we'll meet again, this creates uncertainty, making you more anxious and likely to seek approval, thus giving the manipulator the upper hand. Lastly, gaslighting is perhaps the most sinister. It involves denying reality to make you doubt your perceptions and sanity. By repeatedly questioning your memory and belittling your feelings, a gaslighter can gain significant psychological control, leading you to question what you know to be true. Understanding these techniques is crucial for maintaining personal boundaries and mental health. If you wish to explore more about manipulation and how to protect yourself, numerous resources are available. Books like In Sheep's Clothing by George K. Simon and Who's Pulling Your Strings by Harriet Breaker provide deep insights into recognizing and handling manipulative behavior. Remember, the power lies in awareness and the refusal to play into the hands of manipulators. By staying informed and vigilant, you can navigate your social interactions more safely and confidently.